Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying three very random items that were sent to us from Sarah in California. Thank you, Sarah. We have the dark cho chocolate covered marzipan. This is from Germany. And then we have the Dalman's. These are, um, Dalman's makes Stroop waffles. They make like the best Stroop waffles ever. These are caramel bites, so they are smaller. And I've got um, the market of it at Edgewood, um, the market s'more bark. So I can't wait to try that. So we're gonna try, I think we're gonna try the, the marzipan first, the dark chocolate covered marzipan. It says one bar is. You want an eye for you, just gonna break it. I'll just break it. One bar is 250 calories. And, and you are a huge lover of marzipan. I do, I love marzipan. I think it's okay. It's fine, just bite it. Just easier. Now see, I love that. You know what the texture first reminds me of? I love that almond. It doesn't remind me of that after you've, like it's warmed up and softened. Right. Right at first it reminds me of uh, coconut, almost. Right I, at the beginning. Because it's the kind texture. of firm and chunky. Yes. The texture Very would almond. remind you of coconut that's been firmly packed together. If you like almond and dark chocolate, this is delicious. It's just ground up almonds is what yeah. it tastes like to me. Yeah, it's, it's <laughs> very, very delicious. Yeah, that's one I could pass on. I think mean, it wasn't bad, but. I like that a lot. It wouldn't be anything I would go for like regularly. This, uh, these are the Dalman's um, um, caramel bits. They are four waffles, it's 140 calories. cookies normally a stroop waffle you warm it up mm -hmm. you get your cup of coffee or tea and it's big and you lay it on top of the cup and it softens and the uh, caramel in the middle and then you eat it fabulous these would be good warmed up if you put them on a plate stick them in the microwave for like Five seconds. You taste the cinnamon. Mm -hmm. They're good. Mm -hmm. They are good. They're they are very tough and chewy though. They are. And but these, if you were to microwave with those for even two or three seconds, they would soften mm -hmm. up enough to where they would be perfect. These are the size of those Eggo mini pancakes that yeah. you could get in the box, and you just put those in a on a plate in the microwave. Same thing for this. Yeah. And that has a terrific flavor. It tastes mm -hmm. like cinnamon good. toast. Yeah, I can. I can very, I can very cook. good flavor. I like those a lot. They're very good. They need to be heated up. And now this is the marketed Edgewoods. Have you opened? This no, I have not. You just need to rip it. <laughs> this is their s'mores bar. And I looked up the marketed Edgewood, and it is actually a local grocery store for Sarah and her family. So you just want to get a piece that's already broken. Yeah. You know what? It's thick. Mm-hmm. I thick those. It almost has a fudgy flavor. I haven't got really a piece with anything in it. Gosh, that's good. Mine's all been chocolate. This one. I'm wanting another one. Get out of my way, Kevin. Mm-mm-mm. That's incredible. I'm gonna say this though. It's very, very good. There's not enough of stuff. Mm. I think it's perfect. Although the chocolate bark is very good just by itself. But I mean, there's some hunks here like this. There's nothing in that. Well, there's one piece there and one piece there, but all the rest of it is empty. I'm gonna tell you, I think it's incredible. It is I good. think it's perfect just the way it is. Mm. I don't think they need to add one more thing. This is going stuff. to be very dangerous in the house. And let me tell you what makes this different than most bark, at least for me, is the texture of it. It has, there's like a, I'm trying to find a small piece that I'm both so guilty. There is a, um, it has a, you can feel the, the uh, granules of sugar. That's what it feels like to me. It feels like I can feel the sugar as I'm eating it. I, I love that. That is absolutely fun. The texture is wonderful. I love the texture. I love the quality of the chocolate. It's not like you're eating a candy bar. It's much um, mm. softer than that. Mm -hmm. It's not as crisp as a candy bar. And I love the, the thickness of it. Mm -hmm. 
Like I said though, and I mean you really, each chunk you really only get like one or two pieces. So you're gonna be eating, just know that I you're gonna be- salt. That you're gonna be eating just, uh, just the chocolate for a lot of it. Yeah, which, which is fine. I would make it's good. so good. It's really good. But, but um, I, 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 I never took got three a bites and I, I just got salt. I never got a gram. Um, that's my favorite thing here. I, I would take that. Oh, out of the three, it's 100% my favorite. Oh, is it your soup? Yeah. Well, I the mean. The van I don't really care for. The street balls are really good, but you have to heat them up. This is just a really good, like, dessert. It's it's awesome. It really, or really is. Treat. It's not a dessert. So, it's a treat. Sarah, I have a feeling she probably bought this for us, and she and her family have not tried it themselves. I could be wrong, but. If you haven't, you should. If you haven't, you need to try it because I'm telling you, that that is incredible mm -hmm. bark. They probably and it have all kinds of different. Like s'mores. They probably have all kinds of different barks. They probably do, but flavors. that is so good. Yeah, it's very very good. So I hope you all enjoyed the video. I, if I can find links to anything, I'll put it below. Now I'm not going to be able to find. Uh, I've already tried to find the market at Edgewood because I was going to see if they had any other ones, and they don't. I can go to their website, but I didn't see a place to like shop to actually like find that. So, uh, but if I can, I'll put a link for these below and thanks for watching.